How does a tanker truck on the highway stay under control with all that liquid sloshing around? Even with a steady load, the distribution of weight towards the front or back of a trailer can have a substantial impact on stability. SOLIDWORKS flow simulation can show me what's really going on inside the tank. I can evaluate different baffle plate designs and ultimately create a tanker that is easier to control and makes us all safer on the road. I have a baffle design that I'd like to test out and the wizard takes me through a step-by-step -step setup that makes it easy to create a flow simulation project. Here I'll make my study time dependent and enable the free surface option which allows me to simulate the interface between liquid and gas. I'd like to simulate the truck accelerating from a rest, turning to the left and right, and then decelerating, and I'll accomplish this by making the direction of gravity dependent on time. Now, there are only two fluids in my study, air and diesel, so I'll simply add these in and leave all other values at their default settings. And that's all it takes to set up my simulation. The flow simulation study tree is just like the SOLIDWORKS tree, and I can move from top to bottom specifying any additional details. Here I'll add a condition that my tank is initially half filled with diesel, though I can easily simulate the filling process itself. Besides seeing the fluid move inside the tank, I'd like some hard numbers to back up my design choices so I'll specify some goals to gather this information for me. Let's set global goals to monitor the forces by direction. This is a time dependent study so it's going to take some time to solve. Luckily SOLIDWORKS provides real time feedback during the calculations so I can see how my simulation is going while it happens instead of waiting to the very end. Now once results are in it's time to create some plots. While there is a huge tool set for visualizing the fluids I'm just using one surface plot and one isosurface to display the fluid in the tank. But how do I show this changing over time? Well that's where animations come in and through the use of another friendly wizard my animation is ready to go in seconds. This looks awesome and while I'm happy with the design maybe my coworker thinks he has better ideas. Lucky for me I can make use of SOLIDWORKS configurations and simply clone this simulation to any design iteration without rework. Using the comparison tool to visualize our ideas side by side, it's easy to see who created the most stable design, and the goals we created earlier provide the hard facts. Perhaps it's time to import these results into a structural analysis and find out if the baffle plate designs are strong enough. Or even ask flow simulation to iteratively vary the plate size and thickness, optimizing our design for minimum material usage and maximizing cost savings. The best solutions are not just great designs, but they have to be communicated clearly. SOLIDWORKS flow simulation is designed to give you a cutting edge in both presentation deliverables and hard engineering data. All SOLIDWORKS simulation products are built into the same interface you already know how to use, so why not add this level of detail to your next project and really stand out from your competition? Call us today for a software demonstration or a hands-on test drive.